Project Pals. Today we're building a garden bed out of some simple two by two by sixes. No, what is that? What is that, Heather? What did, what did, I don't remember either. Anyway, we've just bound them together with some braces, and we've dug up the, the earth and took out uh, grass and um, big roots. And now we're about to lay down our flattened paper boxes. Quarter, quarter. Bleh. And now we're about to lay down our flattened out boxes to prevent weeds from coming through and also to feed the soil once they start to cane. All right, we'll be back with you soon. All right, here we have Aiden Jantz. He's about to put the very first flattened box in the garden bed. You feel good about it, Bubba? I do. Okay, awesome. Well, you I know, still, you can do it. You're a tough guy, right? I know. I am a tough guy, but it's still... Careful. Trouble. We better stop filming so we can help with this. All right, bye. All right, tell them what we've done, honey. So we have just put down our cardboard, and now we're about to put the leaves down. Awesome. And limbs. How are you feeling about it? Good. Yeah? Aiden, how you feel? I mean... Honestly, I feel great about it, even though I tripped and fell. I, I, I actually felt scared at that point. Okay. But afterwards, I, I regained my strength. And, of course you did, because you're the big and, guy, right? And, of course. And, <laughs> and I have always, always wanted to help, okay. even though there's a massive reward. So we've just uh, done our layer of leaves. And next, we're putting limbs in. And now I'm going to be putting all of these limbs in. But he's going to spread them out good. Right, Aiden? Yeah. So here we go. Limbs over, over there. Limbs over there and over here. And all of this will create fertilizer as it decays and also help us with not having to put so much work, dirt in there. So, all right. Check you soon. Bye. So the tree limbs have been put in. I think you got it. And now these guys are putting these uh, T-posts in the ground so we can put a trellis in the middle for our climbing vegetables. Our um, cucumbers, squash, zucchini, and I think green beans? Yeah. Green beans? Yeah. All right. That's one po in. That's in. We need three more. And now Heather is working on the other post for the other side uh, the other post for that side of the trellis for and the then we'll put part, and then we'll be t putting two more on this side yeah but for the first part and then i will be finishing it up okay there's big guy doing that hey, post yep i got it i'm fine we really uh should have got a, a post driver but uh, we didn't want to spend the money <laughs> we're using a hammer we needed a mallet we couldn't find it you're getting close, big guy. Getting there. close. On top, on top. Hey, you getting work out today, you know. All right, so we got our poles in the ground, which was not an easy task. Kudos to uh, Aiden and Heather. And now we're putting down our first layer of dirt. Oh, never mind. Go back over there. You saw. I know. Heather says there's a snake in there, but I don't see one. Y'all see one? Oh, I see it now. There it is. Uh -huh. Hi, baby. I don't know if you're in the video or not. Can't tell. So, uh, we ran out of dirt. Only about six inches there, and we need at least eight. So I had to order more dirt, and we'll go pick it up when I get the notice that it's ready. Um, need some opinions out there. Eight, ten, or eleven inches for a garden bed. What do you say? Thank you. All right, so we had to go. Uh, all right, so we had to go buy more dirt. 
because we were only at six inches. And we're loading in, we got two more left. That's gonna be an oregano plant. And down here, got a little bitty cedar box. I think it's gonna be cilantro and spinach. Still deciding on that. Anyway, that's where we are now. And here comes uh, Aiden and Heather bringing in the last bit of the dirt for this project we've been working on. You exhausted, Heather? My back is screaming at me. Mine too. Here with my hard working buddy here today, Aiden Jantz. Yep. Aiden, do you want to tell them what we just did? Well, so we just did a full 15 bag dirt assignment, but it was a lot of work, so. It was, huh? I'm just gonna skip to the point. It's like, I'm just saying, that was tough. Yeah. And if you. And we you, still gotta do the seeds. And if you guys ever try this at home, make sure you get somebody strong to lift those to the soil or dirt bags or whatever you wanna call them. That's right. That's right. Later. Peace. So right now we're putting the seeds in the ground. Heather's making hoes and making sure the spaces are right. And Aiden is putting them in the dirt. So right now, uh, Heather has made the spacing. Aiden is putting it in. These are cherry tomatoes. All right, buddy. All right, our plastic uh, name tags didn't arrive, so I had to make some temporary ones. So far, we got corn, bell pepper, cherry tomatoes. And over here, got a me. lot of corn. And what you don't see is there's marigolds planted too, but I didn't have signs. Over and here, we got cilantro, cilantro and spinach. spinach. Yeah. You call so Aiden work. is finishing the corn up right now. And then, then we'll be done with corn. And guys, this is what you call farm work. <laughs> we were putting our seeds in that egg carton, keep the wind from blowing them away. So we made a makeshift trellis out of a tea post and a cattle panel. And over here, we've got an owl to keep the critters away from our seeds. We put eggshells down, add a little calcium to the soil. So the Project Pals have completed another job. Woo! Hey. And what do we say? We say teamwork makes, makes the, the dream, dream work. work. That's right. All right, we're dirty, we're stinky. We're ready to shower and have some dinner. Peace out, guys. Stay tuned, and we love you. Peace. Peace out. You want to say anything? No? Okay. <laughs>